Welcome back to Pennsylvania Outdoor Life. This is that segment that we show you photos that you've sent to us. You gotta remember that muzzleloader bear season growing in popularity. The first couple photos in this week's People in Places, very successful bear hunters. We'll begin things this week with 16-year-old Will Reese and his very first black bear. Will shot his bear while hunting with his father, Brian, at their hunting cabin located near Ricketts Glen State Park. He downed his black bear using his great-grandfather's Remington 6mm rifle. Way to go, Will. Here's Gino Ginichetti of Dallas and his very first black bear. He shot his on October 17th. Gino downed his black bear with his Matthews V3 compound bow and Rage broadheads. Todd Haddon had to wait 44 years, but he finally got to put a tag on his very first bear. Todd's black bear was shot using a crossbow while hunting in Wayne County. Way to go, Todd. Next, we see Ed Coleman of Richmondale and his second black bear. Ed's black bear weighed 150 pounds and was downed using a Remington 50 caliber muzzleloader, and he was hunting in Fell Township. Take a look at Jake Pennypacker of Gordon and his first black bear after 24 years of buying a bear tag. Jake's black bear had an estimated live weight of 191 pounds and was shot with a 50 caliber inline muzzleloader. Great bear, Jake. Let's check out some big buck photos. Kenny Reese of Bangor is seen here with the eight point buck that he shot on October 21st while hunting in Stroud Township. Kenny's buck field dressed at 180 pounds and was shot using his crossbow. Check out the huge eight point buck that Ray Nowitzki of Plymouth shot on October 23rd while hunting with his grandson Kai, Zach, and son-in-law Wayne Kastner, and they were hunting on Plymouth Mountain. Ray's buck sported eight points and was shot at a distance of 37 yards with his Barnett crossbow. He tells us while tracking his big buck, he came across two large sheep's head mushrooms. That sounds like steak and mushrooms to me. Great Buck Ray. And here's Adam Fulkerson of Bloomsburg, along with his son Connor, and the buck that he shot with his Bowtech compound bow on October 24th. Adam's buck had 10 points and a 21 inch spread. He tells us that after a few buck grunts, this beauty walked right in the 36 yards for the shot. That's a great buck, Adam, congratulations. And with all of these successful sportsmen out there, we'll put a close to this week's edition of Pennsylvania People and Places. Congratulations, everybody. And of course, we're asking you for your photos. Go to our website, click on the slideshow, and enter them there and give us enough information. I know there's a lot of fish photos and deer and bear photos to come, so do that for us. We're going to take a short break, and we'll be right back.